What's up? This is the Parker Fly Mojo in banana, banana. yellow. Banana. 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 That's right. Banana yellow. It's a pretty nice guitar. Look at all the buttons and the switches. Banana. Look at that. Look at that. That's great. Does so many things, so many things. Roland ready. The piezo up down for the guitar synth controls. Gee, there's just so much fun things you can do with it. Set this thing up today for my friend Anthony. <laughs> there's no buzzing anywhere. It doesn't fret out when you bend. So things super fast playing. So let me go over some of the controls. We have the master volume for the guitar. This is the magnetic neck. This is both. This is bridge. This guy here is your tone. And a coil tap. Sounds great when you have both pickups on and coil tap, but it's more strat-like. Next is the down and the up for the synth. This red light comes on when the guitar is plugged in, automatically this turns on. This would be both the piezo and the magnetic, which you really can't tell in this setup that I have right now is not a true stereo split. And all the way over would be the piezo, but because I have it being shipped down the GR cable, 13 pin cable, the piezo does not work. The next thing is this little toggle in the middle. The mini toggle is actually a combination of the guitar, the guitar synth, guitar synth by itself. Which we can sustain if we like to do some practicing with. I can bring in the guitar. Parkerfly Mojo, the Mojos were all mahogany. It's a great guitar. If you're a Parker fan and you find a good deal, I recommend you grab one. Thanks for watching. Take care and one more banana from the bunch. <laughs>